So I've recently upgraded to the Spectrum controller, mostly for its DSM capabilities. I like it, and I went ahead and upgraded my larger quad to a Spectrum receiver, and I found it kind of difficult to figure out the wiring for PPM on, with my CC3D board. Uh, I tried all kinds of things, left it for a while, came back to it, uh, searched on the internet, and this is what I ended up going with, and uh, uh, I'm going to go ahead and tear this back apart. I need to clean up some wiring, and while I'm doing that, I'm going to show you my setup and how I got it to work. Now that I've got everything taken apart, you can see the main part of the receiver and its little satellite here. Uh, I've just got one, one set of wires plugged into the PPM section there. It's uh, ground on the top, power in the middle, and the data wire on the bottom, which in my case happens to be black as well, so that's kind of confusing. But it comes off of the receiver port and not the um, flexi or main port like some of the other instructions show. And maybe that's for DSM, but in this case PPM worked for me uh, and I'm happy with the setup. So I've got my new wire attached. Uh, it's a nice clean build. And I'm going to go ahead and set all this stuff back up. And I'm going to go through LibrePilot and go through the, some of the setup that I, I did previously and show you how I found my wiring set up. So let's go ahead and do that. So we're going to plug in to LibrePilot and go through the vehicle setup wizard. In this case, I'm just going to go ahead. Now here's where we see all our selections for the different types of controller setups. Uh, on the CC3D it's giving us a uh, spectrum satellite, which I'm not doing right now. Uh, that's if I just wanted to set up the, the little satellite guy. And I want longer range than that on this craft. So I'm going to go with the PPM setup and click next. Now this is the interesting part. For standard ESCs, if I click to the next screen, uh, this is something that I hadn't found before. I never really clicked on this little connection diagram, but it shows you right off the bat how you're supposed to set it up and how it wants to connect to this uh, receiver. You can tell here it wants the uh, black, red, and white, the first three, to go into the PPM section. If I go back here and I select the rapid ESCs, and go next, it's going to show me that it wants the the sixth, uh, the eighth pin, input number six, to go into the PPM signal. So be sure that no matter where you see the correct version, go ahead and click that connection diagram based on your previous setup selections. Uh, the rest of the settings are, are pretty normal. Um, you, get, you guys know most of this stuff. And there you have it. Um, get yourself out there flying. I think this is a really great setup. I love Spectrum. I love the, uh, I like flying all the tiny whoops, uh, microcopters, and everything in between. So Spectrum worked great for me. And I'm going to go back out and fly. See ya.